The Per Temps Network Qualifier, this is the second leg, three mile, and it's our first um, hurdle race for the day, 0 to 140. And favourite up the top is Consequence of the Stars, Joshua Sutherland, Executive Director, Young Gay Blue Moon, Batter Sierra, Crossbow Creek, Secret Lake, Ray Ray, Historical, Falun Gong, the Aristocrat, Fantasy Man, Claustrophobic, King's College Boy, Dresden Dynamo, Only Fools and Horses, Black Autumn, Grain Ambience, Tomorrow's World, Gunner Wellborn, Kate of the Glen, and number 21, Storm Dove for Alex Cherry. Racing. And they skip over that first flight. Twelve more to get over. <coughs> Pushing through with Storm Dove. <coughs> Out wide are only fools and horses. They go past the winning post. I think two laps to go. Wide there is Dresden Dynamo. Now on the field, fans back with those uh, ones unfortunately caught wide. But Storm Dove, that's where you want to be. Down on the fence and up front. And it's Storm Dove. Alex Sherry. His eye catching silks. His and the Dresden Dynamo. Two best looking silks in the league at the moment, I reckon. And of course, you can't go past Hollywood Hinton's pink. And only fools and horses. Four Hollywooders in second. Third is Batter Sierra, Molly at Surf with the German flag there. Grain Ambience into fourth. Secret Late on its outside. Then we've got Historical Young Gay Blue Moon. Uh, Black Autumn. <coughs> Consequence of the Stars. Tomorrow's World. Fantasy Man. Ray Ray. Crossbow Creek. Falun Gong. Kate of the Glen for Martin Leadham. Sitting on the fence. Easy run for the moment. Executive Director for Paul Rhodes, King's College Boy, the Aristocrat Dresden Dynamo and Gunner Wellborn. <coughs> Field strung out here. At least 15 lengths first to last. Skip over the sixth flight. Pecking at it badly there was a King's College boy. Almost lucky to be still standing, really. They race down the straight here. Oh, one's getting pulled up. It's Paul Rhodes' horse. Executive Director. Is out of the race and also Dresden Dynamo getting pulled up as well. Lap to go. And another one getting pulled up. Gunner Wellburn. That's the thing about the hunt. And another one getting pulled up as well. Ray Ray. That's quite indiscriminate. As to who get pulled up, who loses a jockey and who falls. And it can... Two or three horses out in a race can change the dynamics greatly and open up chances for a lot of trainers. We're inside the mile. And Storm Dove and only fools and horses take the eighth flight. Third is historical, Batter Sierra. Fantasy Man, Claustrophobic, Grain Ambience, Tomorrow's World, Kate of the Glen, 
is off the fence, midfield. Secret Lake, Crossbow Creek, Young Gay, Blue Moon, Falun Gong, Consequence of the Stars, Black Autumn, King's College Boy, and The Aristocrat. It's Storm Dove. Calling a taxi there is only Fools and Horses getting pulled up as the Aristocrat. Storm Dove joined by Fantasy Man. Or Storm Dove jumped that one poorly and now drops back through the field and moving into the race. Kate of the Glen has circled the field. And at the three and a half, it's Kate of the Glen from Fantasy Man. Falun Gong, Young Gay, Blue Moon, Crossbow Creek, Claustrophobic, Historical. Anyone's race. Two and a half furlongs. Come down, down to the second last flight and Fantasy Man takes the lead from Falun Gong, Kate of the Glen. Then Crossbow Creek, Claustrophobic, Historical, Batter Sierra. The one and a half. One more to get over. Fantasy Man looking good. Jumps it nicely from Falun Gong. Crossbow Creek. Claustrophobic. Nothing else can win. They run on down to the half and nothing else can win except Fantasy Man. And Fantasy Man is everyone's dream and comes down to the line and wins from Crossbow Creek. Falun Gong third. And that was a good win for David Robinson with Fantasy Man. That was a strong winner. Second was Crossbow Creek for Ghost Sappers. Third, Falun Gong for Darren Thompson.